Okay, let's talk about maps a little bit. It's a typical GPS map. I can search for directions. You'll notice right now I have Kansas State University marked, and I also have my house over there marked. But where in the world do I want to go? Hmm, let me see. Uh, I'm going to go to Stonehenge. That's a place I'd like to go. So I can use the pinch method to blow my screen up, get a better look, and as soon as it refreshes, sometimes the internet has to catch up with this. So there's a pretty good view of Stonehenge. But see that little orange guy right there? Well, if I tap my finger on him, it will open up a live 360 view of Stonehenge. Now, whenever you see one of these arrows, if you touch it, it will take you deeper in to that particular direction you're going. So let's say I want to get closer to those rocks, and closer to those rocks, and closer to that rock. Oh, it's going to take me a minute. Down here in the corner where you see the little circle map, if you touch that, it will take you back. In the bottom corner also, there's a little like page flipped up. You flip that up, you'll notice you can look at the map in different uh, formats. You can turn traffic on if you are in a city, and here's how I drop a new pin. So now I have a pin. Let's say I want to look at it from the outside view. I can move it, and let's see if my little uh, Cameo pops up. Yep, there it is. So if I click my Cameo, there we go. There's an outside view of the Google, or of Stonehenge, excuse me.